suspended Makati City Mayor Junjun Binay has decided to leave the City Hall today. Darlene Basingan tells us why from Makati City Live. Yes, Darlene. Yes, Jego, after two days of refusal to abide by the Ombudsman's order, suspended Makati City Mayor Junjun Binay has now decided to temporarily step down from office. The suspended mayor of Makati City, Junjun Binay, has decided to leave the city hall today while waiting for the decision of the Court of Appeals on the petition he filed to stop Ombudsman's order to suspend him. In a speech to his supporters, Binay said he decided to vacate his office pending the CA's order so that violence between supporters and police would no longer happen. Dahil po, hindi ko po kayang tiisin na Meron pa hong masaktan, hindi ko pong kayang tiisin na tayo po ay binibigan ng karahasan dito sa ating lungsod na ang mga mamamayang po natin ay naaabala. Ako po ay kahit labag sa aking puso, ako po ay pansamantalang lilisan sa ating city hall. Binay noted he will abide by the court's decision and will not surrender the fight for Makati City. He reiterates that the Ombudsman's order has no basis and that he has a strong argument to stop it. The younger Binay went out of the City Hall building with his father, Vice President Jejumar Binay. After his speech, he hugged his father and then left the premises of the City Hall. However, after they left, the City Hall remains closed even to the employees working there. Because of this, employees tried to barge in again inside the building, causing another violence between them and the police to erupt. Ask my employees to be uh, allowed to enter the city because we need to provide service. Even acting Mayor Romulo Kid Peña could not enter inside the building. He said there is no securing a clearance to get inside. Yung kung makikita nila na nandito po kami para hindi gawin yung mga pagkakamali ng nakaraan. Bagkus, lalo po namin i-improve at patuloy na ipakikita na ang mga namumuno sa bansang Pilipinas ay eh talaga naman pong maayos at marangal. The acting mayor said he will immediately call for a meeting after they secure clearance. He also thanked the Be Nice for following the order and vowed to continue giving the services Makati residents needed. All Binay supporters had already left the Makati City Hall premises but policemen will stay here to ensure that nothing undesirable will happen until the City Hall reopens. Meanwhile, the Southern Police District Bomb Squad, Makati PNP, SWAT and other departments also conducted earlier a brief inspection of the City Hall as part of their security measure. Jago? Thank you, Darlene Basingan reporting live from Makati City.